Sound deadening is a feature available to add to cars, but sometimes you don't need it. How do you know when you should add sound deadening to your car? Sound deadening a car is a good idea if excessive road noise interferes with the audio system or bothers the driver and passengers. Sound deadening involves adding insulation to a car to decrease the noise coming into the car. There are a few essential things about sound deadening. When you should add it, how it works, and where you get it. When do you need sound deadening in your car? Sound deadening has one primary purpose in a car, to decrease the amount of sound coming into the car from the outside. Sound deadening doesn't completely soundproof the car. You can still hear sounds outside the car. However, it can significantly decrease the sound coming in, making sounds less overpowering. Sound deadening is mainly used to block out road noise. Road noise is the sound that a car makes as it drives. The wheels spinning very quickly on the pavement and propelling the car at high speeds can make a lot of noise. The tires moving across the road surface make a lot of noise. This also makes the frame and paneling of your car shake and rattle, causing more noise. So, there is a lot of noise on the inside of a car, and sound deadening can make it so there is less noise. Peace and quiet. Some people are just very bothered by the road noise. While some people get used to the noise and aren't bothered by it, others can't stand to have it there all the time. If you frequently think about how you don't like the noise your car makes, Investing in some sound deadening may be worth it. It will make your drive much quieter and more peaceful. Audio interference. Many people like to rock out to music in their car, listen to audiobooks or podcasts, or talk on the phone through the car system. Unfortunately, a lot of road noise can interfere with the speaker system in your car. The road noise tends to compete with the speakers. You may need to crank up the volume way more to hear it properly, which can be bad for your ears. Sound deadening can help you with this problem. If there is less road noise coming into the car, it won't interfere as much with the audio. It will sound much better, and the volume won't have to be up as high. Conversation Road noise can also interfere with the conversation between passengers and the driver. I had a few experiences when I couldn't hear what anyone in the front or the driver's seat was saying, even when I was only one row behind. Road noise can make it harder for the driver and passengers to communicate. They have to speak louder to hear one another, which can put a lot of strain on the voice after a while. How does sound deadening work? Sound deadening is an insulation that hinders the ability of sound to travel into your car. Put a layer of rubbery material between the inside and the metal surfaces on the outside of the car. Noise tends to travel well through metal, but it doesn't travel very well through rubber or similar materials. Blocking the metal with a rubbery material will slow the sound, so less noise will get through. Sound deadening tends to come in the form of a thick, rubbery mat that you put on the floor of your car. This is where most of the road noise comes from. You can also attach sound deadening to your doors, the bottom and sides of the trunk, and the roof. For more details, click the link below to read my full blog post on how to know if you need sound deadening in your car, if you're tired of the unwanted noise in your car. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.